What is going on, guys? I am Jada Black. Shout out to everybody, sir. I didn't learn of this until today because uh, I've been working on some other content. It just seems the news just happens all on one day. You go a couple days without really seeing much, and then bam, there's something there. But I'm going to talk about J.R. Smith. J.R. Smith allegedly is messing around on his wife with actress Candace Patton. And for those of you who don't know who she is, she plays Iris on the Flash television show. She is a love interest of the Flash. Now, I spoke about J.R. Smith before dealing with side chicks. He was dealing with the IG model. He ended up just not dealing with her anymore and, you know, being committed to his wife. That was, what, less than a year ago? Now, he's in this situation because he got caught up. And this is exactly why. When you're having a secret relationship and you're dealing with, you know, females that you're dating who are all over your page, don't go and take her dogs for walks. Don't attend the same parties as them together, because sooner or later, people are going to put two and two together. And that's what happened in this particular situation. People put two and two together. Now, we all know that when an athlete you know, when he has opportunity uh, to be a part of the league. And when you're playing sports, you know, you're going to be on the road and you may have a relationship. There's going to be groupies. Uh, but in this situation, Jr. is not in the league right now. Jr. is home uh, and he has you know, idle time on his hands, which he could be spending with his wife, but he obviously isn't. If he's going to parties and walking the dog of another woman. Now, Candace Patton, to, you know, she's not an Instagram model. She's not, to me, an attention seeker. If you go on her Instagram, you know, it's just a average, you know, you wouldn't even know she was a celebrity from some of the posts. You know, that's just how she carries herself. She carries herself seemingly in a classy manner. And J.R. Smith is the last guy I think I would see her dating it's just that's just honest truth I, I don't i wouldn't really see her dating jr smith but you know opposites can attract and maybe it did in this particular situation now this is not a good look for jr of course but this is not a good look for candace Patton because if you're dealing with a married man you have to understand the optics of the situation this man has a whole wife why is he spending time with you why is he walking your dog? And to make the situation even worse, J.R. Smith went and deleted a bunch of posts going back to 2017. And I believe he deleted those posts because Candace Patton is all over those posts, either liking those posts or commenting. As a matter of fact, uh, he commented on her uh, Halloween post and she responded back. You know, and you, for those who know, for those who don't really pay attention, if you have a big following, a lot of times celebrities aren't going to be able to respond. But if you see her responding quickly to what he's saying, that lets you know that, you know, they're really, really cool with each other. Now, I just want to know this. Why is a married man in J.R. Smith walking your dog, Candace Patton? Like, why, why is it that women, you know, who seemingly has their mindset together, they're not attention seekers, they're not Instagram models, because y'all know that there are females that say that we as men are chasing behind the IG models. Well, Candace Patton isn't an IG model. Why is she allegedly dealing with a married man? And the reason why I believe this is true is, once again, they're spending time with each other. Um, they're basically... Um, accidentally getting each other caught up now what jr has to come to terms with is if he doesn't want to be with his wife he needs to leave his wife why would you stay with somebody that is clear that you're not really that attracted to anymore that you really don't want to be with anymore why would you stay with her now his wife did respond she put up a post and it was sad man she put up this lengthy post explaining to other people why she stays with a guy who continuously messes around on her and gets caught up and it was almost like she was having a conversation with herself it's sad man because you stay with this guy you stay with this guy and he does nothing to make a fool out of you 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 really do need to reevaluate your situation now i'm not one of those people that says that at every you know spot of trouble you should leave a marriage i'm not one of those people but 
if you've accepted what JR, who JR is and what he does, don't put up lengthy Instagram posts just trying to uh, cater to your, you know, the people that follow you to make to, so they can, uh, so they can feel sorry for you. So, you know, they see you as a victim because that's what it seems like in a situation. I'm not saying that she isn't because she is, but apparent, but JR has been doing JR for a long time. He has. This is nothing new. And the fact that he's not really doing much right now and he has time on his hands and he's spending that time with somebody who's an actress, somebody who, again, just from looking at her IG, she does not carry herself as an attention seeker. She's not one of these people who are out here who you think are looking for a rapper or an athlete to be with. It's just a situation where, you know, she's, you know, up and coming as far as her career is concerned but she still goes after a married man i have said this over and over again a lot of women out there are very attracted to married men or men who are in relationships they are not attracted to men who are single they think something is wrong with a man who is single they really do they don't want to take the time to really go and date and get to know men to see if that relationship would work. They want to take the easy route. They want her to take it. They, um, they want to take them say her. They want to take the easy route. They want to be able to, uh, deal with a guy who already has a wife. I don't know if it's because of trust thing. You think he's going to be able to keep a secret because low key, you have these females, even though they may carry themselves in a classy manner, who you think are trying to level up, they're still thizots at heart. At heart, they're still thizots. They're not good girls. It's all image. It could be all image because again, she's an actress and she wants to portray herself a certain way, but this is not a good look. Now, again, this is all alleged, but do y'all really think that this isn't true? Do y'all really think that these are lies? She got, I mean, he got caught up. That's why he's deleting posts. Why are you deleting posts if it's not true? And I don't even think he's denied it. His wife is putting out posts, so we know it's true. We know that this is true. And for Candace, this is not a good look. It really isn't. Because you probably have female friends that are in relationships, that are married. How are they going to feel about bringing their husbands around you? Again, you have to look at the fact that married men and men who are in relationships they are put they are considered top tier because they have made a commitment to a woman and because they are attached to a woman they have a family and no matter if a, i'm saying it doesn't matter but nowadays it, it just doesn't matter if a woman comes from you know a two-parent household or single parent household if a woman wants a man, she's going to do whatever it takes to get that man. She's going to she's going to do whatever it takes to get that man. And the thing is this, if you're going to be a side piece, you got to get good at being a side piece. You can't be out here getting yourself caught up. And there's no telling how long this situation was going on because you know, he you no know, JR Smith went back and deleted posts from all the way back to 2017. So this could have been a lot of flirting going on that he wanted to remove. It could have been posts and pictures where he was actually around her, you know, that guilty conscience, man. And I'm pretty sure Candace Patton isn't the only one, but I can't feel sorry for these women who get with these dudes who do nothing but waste their time and waste their good years to the point to where when they're older and they realize that they've wasted time being a side piece now they're upset at all men why are you upset at all men when you chose to get with this guy a guy who clearly can't be faithful a guy who clearly is a simp because the reason why i'm saying is a simp because dude why are you walking her dog that's not your woman why are you walking her dog are you trying to win her over you really don't have to go that far that is because you are basically in a relationship while you're in a relationship. You have a side relationship. And that's going on a lot. But people are getting themselves caught because they're getting their feelings caught into it. Now, maybe JR has feelings for Candace. 
this is why he's out here walking dogs and you know he's in similar he's in you know posts with her and it, it's just it's a it's a mess jr has a family with his wife his wife don't seem to be going nowhere and i think he knows this this is why he's able to do these things and nothing comes of it except for his wife writing lengthy posts to her followers who want to know why she's still with this guy why are you still putting up with it you know if you if you're gonna put up with what he does you need to say that don't put up posts having conversation with yourself talking about why you continue to deal with this and that it is because of the excitement let's be real you got women that they enjoy dealing with a guy who has side chicks i've had women tell me that i probably got multiple women that i'm dealing with that i've had side chicks before and it's like you find that attractive in a guy you find it attractive for a guy to have side chicks okay for well what if he what if you're dating that guy and he has side pieces while he's dating you would you appreciate that would you like that is that attractive is is a guy who has multiple women attractive to you i mean it must be so i should never hear you getting upset with him you know dealing with other women there you know you should not be upset then i honestly think that we are in a day and age where monogamy especially if you have money and resources monogamy really doesn't mean anything like it, it really doesn't if you think about it monogamy really doesn't mean what it used to because a lot of these guys have multiple women and you got women too who are married in relationships that have men outside their relationships but they're better at their situation than men are men i don't know what it is man we get sloppy when we deal well not me but when when some of y'all are dealing with women outside a relationship and you end up putting yourself on blast 